Chabone, my sheep paste person, that the image of any two Teddy Brown stuff, Brom featuring DJ Geek Ganja. Uh, now, I personally thought that this was featuring Dafina Zashiri as well, turns out no. Um, but she did say that he's the first artist that she signed, so supporting him is like supporting her. And you know how much we love her on this channel. So, without further ado, let's go. Like, comment, subscribe. Let's check out Brom. We've heard him on Murder on the Dance Floor and he killed that shit, so let's go. Smoking on John, up in the knees, we got them all, we got them all. We smoking on John, up in the knees, we got them all, we got them all. One thing I will say just before this starts <clears throat> if any of you have heard a, a UK artist called M. Honcho, this sounds exactly like M. Honcho. I like it though. I'm going back for that. Up in the knees, we got them all, we got them all, we smoking ganja. Up in the knees, we got them all, we got them all. No se skinny hala, te par marihuana bro. Adete na provo, adete tim sado. No se skinny hala, te par marihuana bro. Jeff Mas Vedi tu bot moina Jet Kakach koina even when we on Stop it man This like the way that the beats kicked in as well The way that the bass is kicked in Oh duh. This is like that 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 melodic rap trap flow Like I say M Honcho Nave Smalls these are these are these are pioneers at this shit, and this is this is music that I've been listening to. This type of music I've been listening to for years now. I love this shit. Stoner shit. Let's go. <laughs> What I like as well, um, obviously Eleanor was uh, involved somehow, I don't know how, um, but this might have been done, like the video might have been done around the same time as Dafina Zashiri and uh, Eleanor was uh, fine, that came out like last week, maybe the week before. Um, I even like the, the undertones, like the ad-libs that he's got running throughout this as well, and the melodies that he's put behind this track. It's nice and it really goes with his voice. And I like that his voice is sort of centered around these ad libs. I really like this. I, I, I genuinely do like this. This is going on the playlist. Is he saying that they're going to be smoking weed until they're like really old? <laughs> Oh, 
<laughs> Glazed expressions, they don't know what the fuck he's talking about. They are high. They are high. <clears throat> okay, man. Well, to be fair, I'm, I'm very impressed by that record. If, if, if that's like, if that's the sort of music that, that he comes up with on a regular basis, I'd be more than happy to hear an entire project from Ron. <clears throat> Personally, um, all I've heard him on is that, and then Murder on the Dance Floor, and the 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 verse that he had in that, he killed it. Um, yeah, he had uh, he had the auto tune in in the feature with the Phoenix of Shiri, and he obviously auto tune is something that he uses quite heavily throughout his music, which I don't mind if it's done correctly, and that is done correctly. That is definitely done correct. Like I say, it sounds sort of like Nave Small's M. Huncho-esque music, but that's the sort of music you can just vibe out to. Light one up, sit down, head back, spark up. Boom, nice cup of tea. But you get to that boring iron when I swing. Um, but yeah, man, I'm, I'm definitely excited to hear more from Ron. Um, I want to hear him on a track with Dafina Zashiri again, like a murder on the dance floor type part two type shit um but yeah man, very excited about this uh and oh my god i didn't even i, I didn't even say anything about the beat right <clears throat> i have been i'd say quiet but probably very harsh about dj geeks uh beats okay i haven't found anything about his beats that i've liked so far this beat however this beat knocked perfectly and it was exactly the, the sort of beat that was needed for a tune if you're going to make one about weed about marijuana about ganja you need to have the vibe right do you know what i mean and the beat is is the vibe do you know what i mean a lot of it's produced by the artist but the main vibe is produced by the beat and dj geek did a phenomenal job on this so well done well done stellar performance from both producer and the actors as well well done to the old guys um and LNL and a little cameo appearance from him as well. So, oh, Teddy Graham stuff. This was sick. 